What's going on, everybody? It's your homeboy, Kevin Line Network here, chilling out, maxing out, doing my thing. All right, y'all. Now, in today's video, we're going to be talking about the Soros PDX 41. Yes. Now, this is basically a Soros Pulse Rifle. It's amazing. Now, um, we're going to be covering the entirety of the gameplay and the stats of it as well. But before we do that, make sure to follow me on Twitch.tv slash Kevin Line Network because we're going to be live streaming in about five minutes. going to live stream for about an hour looking for the Sleeper Simulate. Yeah, boy. All right, now let's get back into this. The Soros PDX 41. Now, the rate of fire and the stability has to be this best perks. Fully maxed out, it can go even further. Now, this rifle has a scope. I think it's specific to Amalon. Basically, it highlights guardians with full supers and strong enemies of the darkness. Basically, that means yellow bars and such. And that's highly helpful because in the mass of enemies you're looking for, the particular ones, that's always helpful. Now, it's right here, the Soro 41. Now, I don't know if, you know, that has anything to do with the gun actually having a 41 in this name as well. Not entirely sure. But hey, all right, now I'm actually just leveling up a tiny bit with my Motor Light. See, I like the way they're doing Motor Light on this game, like on the TLC, T, DLC, I mean, because you can just level up quick weapons and it's not overpowered because there's so many new weapons and you only can get so much Motor Light. Now, guys, seriously, I love it. It's awesome. Hammer Forge is also highly handy as well. Now, basically, you can also effectively increase the range, so you really don't have to worry about it. It's something in here called Hand Laid Stock, which basically increases the ability all the way, like, nearly to the end, but it reduces the range a bit. But Range Finder helps out. So, guys, make sure you follow this, because I love this Pulse Rifle. It's very amazing. Great for PvP and even PvP. As well, I'm using PVE right now. Now, guys, it's been Cable Line Network here. Make sure to subscribe because I will be keeping you updated with a whole lot of Destiny Taken King content. And like I said, I will be live streaming in a few minutes, so make sure to check me out on there. Peace out, and talk to you later.